Hello there and welcome to another tutorial. Today we will learn on how to use Notepad++. You know how to download it, just google it, install it and we're just gonna go to the server files. We got the latest pack here release and we're gonna go just simply to data and this is a place that we are going to work with. This is Notepad++. Now the first thing you need to do, once you run it and install it, go to plugins, plugins admin and search for compare. So you have compare here, you click on it and click here on the next right install. It will restart and install. So simply I'm going to show in this tutorial on how to use Notepad++ and work with these server files. I'm going to set everything into Notepad++. And then we start it. Okay. So as you see here, Notepad Plus Plus has different kind of colors, and that's amazing to just notice the difference. And for an example, if I just choose this zero, it will um, it will highlight where 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 we have zero else. So this is very important and useful. So you can see, okay, where is the zero? Where 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 is everything disabled? You know what I mean? For this kind of option here all right so this is a shop and as you see we have here potions and then just some default things here going on now what I do if I'm not using the uh, premium toolkit for editing shops or monsters I just edit with notepad plus plus which means if I want to add a new item I just copy another item uh, paste in order to not to have so many spaces, you have to copy it from here like this. And then it will just add extra in it. So what I mostly do is just I just copy paste and I change for example 1215 is Jewel of Chaos. And if I want to comment, I can just write Jewel of Chaos in between. But we don't need that. You can put it for yourself if you like. But uh, this is what I do if I want to add new items simply and maybe sometimes I just have to make a list let me make an example of what I mean so if I make the let's say here for example um, 7 8 9 10 now I have a whole set here and I just have to copy paste that to, an, to, put, to put another set I just have to copy paste and change the number of the set so this item now is copy pasted and you just have to change some values if you like okay so simple copy paste method and yeah let's jump into replacing it's very important so if I have here for example like I said everything you choose gets highlighted and you can also just change values by double clicking for example in here inside because it's in quotes so let's try to replace um, all the zeros with one one ones what would you do usually what you would you do is uh, click uh, control F replace zeros to one right and that's gonna change everything so that's a big mistake so you go back and you select for example this here as you see here we have durability zero whatever and we don't want to attach durability so maybe even skill so what you do you select it click control F copy that and click on replace and paste it now you can expand that window a little bit and you can and then I replace it both ways here so now I know what I can replace okay let's add every for every item to have skill option and boom so you see now you didn't touch anything else so this is the best way you can replace and you have to work with this for maybe some hour, an hour or two you guys just have to work with this first and get used to it and then you, it's gonna be like a really fast thing 